The First Amendment's protection for freedom of speech ensures the open exchange of ideas to facilitate political and social change. Because speech concerning public affairs is at the heart of self-governance, it's generally afforded a high degree of First Amendment protection. In Connick v. Myers, we explore whether that high degree of protection applies to speech by a public employee. Sheila Myers worked as an assistant district attorney in the office of New Orleans District Attorney Harry Connick. After five years of prosecuting cases in one criminal court, Myers was transferred to work on cases in a different criminal court. Unhappy about the transfer, Myers expressed dissatisfaction with the office's transfer practices. But Myers' supervisors claimed that her dissatisfaction wasn't shared by others. In response, Myers distributed a questionnaire to poll her colleagues. The questionnaire sought feedback regarding transfer practices, office morale, supervisor relationships, and whether employees felt pressure to work in political campaigns for office-supported candidates. Immediately after learning of the questionnaire, Connick terminated Myers' employment. Myers filed suit against Connick, alleging that her termination was unconstitutional because it penalized her for exercising her constitutionally protected right of free speech. The district court ruled in Myers' favor, and the Fifth Circuit affirmed. The United States Supreme Court granted cert.